Hi, this Apple guru, welcome to my channel. You might face such an issue with your iPhone related to the settings app, such as Apple ID settings is grayed out and you're unable to make changes or access the iCloud. Let's start with the reasons why this happened. First, it might be a restriction you had sit and forgot to toggle it off back. Second, it might be. You missed to agree to the terms and condition of the iCloud. It should be appeared on the setting under the name directly. Third, internet for the settings app might be disabled. Fourth, it might be child account and you apply restriction on the child account. Here is the fix. Let's start with the simple and basic troubleshooting. If it connection issue, use another Wi-Fi network, try to use the cellular data instead. If you're in cellular data and you can't access the iCloud or any feature while you can't access all on Wi-Fi, it means that you disabled the internet over cellular for settings app. Go to settings and tap cellular, then scroll down, toggle settings on as you can see. Now you have access to Apple ID settings and can sign out and all is settled down. My bad, I forgot to mention an important thing. It might cause all these issues. It's the Apple ID update setting, notification, or suggestion. So, if you see update Apple ID suggestions or settings, it should appear like that. Just click and enter your password or passcode if needed. Another reason restriction you might enable it. If your Apple ID is grayed out in settings, if you go to settings on your iPhone or iPad and you can't click your Apple ID, you might have restrictions turned on. Content and privacy restrictions are a part of screen time designed to prevent children from making unwanted changes to their account. If you turn this on for any other reason and want to make changes to your account, you can use these steps on your iPhone. One, go to settings, then tap screen time. Two, tap content and privacy restrictions. Three, if content and privacy restrictions is turned on, scroll down to the allow changes section. Four, tap account changes and set it to allow. If asked, enter your screen time passcode. Voila, you have access now. If you see this useful, do not forget to subscribe to the channel and support us by hitting the like button and share the video and leave a comment. Now let's jump to the other reason. Terms and condition of the iCloud. If you miss this, it might disable the access to this settings. If still appears with the red tag under the name, please agree after reading it. If not present, we need to sign out from the Apple ID and sign in back. I need you attention, please. If you sign out of your Apple ID, it's intensive step. It might cause to lose your data. When you sign out, any information stored in iCloud remains available in iCloud. That information will be removed from your device unless you choose to keep a copy of that data when prompted. So we need to make sure that you have full backup and sync all your data with iCloud. You can skip this step, it's your decision. I will make video how to back up your device and make a copy of your data. Please stay tuned and follow to do not miss up any tutorial. So to sign out from the Apple ID, go to settings and tap your name, scroll down. You have the sign out button. You need your password and follow on screen instruction while signing back. Terms and condition might appear. Agree after reading it. That's it. Hope this was helpful and settle your issue. If your issue still persists and unfortunately you are unable to solve via the step we have done. I recommend let me know by the comments what was the result and I will be more than happy to answer you as soon as I can. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe for more. I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. What other topic or related videos would you like to see? That's all for now, but next time we'll be diving deeper into your next questions. Stay tuned.